will remain here during the course of the winter time. About a third will leave us. There is the hippopotamus in Red Dam. And we're just going to have a list listen and see if we can't hear some alarm calling, some anger from birds or squirrels or the like around here. And all I can hear is the very peaceful calling, of course, of the ring-necked dove. Proop, 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 proop. One or two Franklins. But otherwise, all is peaceful. And I must say, this hippopotamus is not quite in as salubrious a neighborhood as the one in Twin Dams. This one looks a little bit greener and less tasteful, but of course to a hippopotamus that makes not one jot of difference. They don't mind water like this, as long as they've got water to keep them out of the sun, keep them cool and make them feel safe, they're more than happy. I oh know, terrapins. Just to the left, lots and lots of terrapins, they will really enjoy a pan like this. having their morning exercise, you can see them there. <laughs> you can see how they fly, or fly, swim along with their mouths going open and closed. Now in theory they will tell you that a terrapin like that, a serrated hinged terrapin, is an eater of algae, at least of insects. I think that thing is definitely eating algae. Seems to be towing something as well. What is that? A much larger terrapin. What is going on there? Yes, it was another terrapin. Perhaps they're in love on a date. They look like they're having such fun always, I think. <laughs> Laura, you want to know if this is a turtle or not? No, Laura, it is not a turtle. A turtle is a sea-dwelling chelonid. Now, there are three kinds of chelonids that I know of. Turtles, tortoises, and terrapins. A turtle lives in the sea, a terrapin lives in fresh water on land, and that's not the only designation, but that's the easiest way to, uh, to tell them apart, and a tortoise lives on the land. Now, no doubt you do get the odd freshwater turtle, but they're a completely different family. He's having a wonderful time there. The two very, very cross blacksmith lapwings coming into land. <laughs> 